As part of its determination to ensure food security and resilience, the European Union, through ProAct project, has continued its intervention in various communities of Adamawa to boost food security. Numa local government joined four existing benefited local councils in the state as the fifth to partake in the ProAct program of enhancing food security and by extension eradicating poverty. This is the official flag off of the fertilizer and other farm inputs for dry season farmers in Numan through the collaborative efforts of Crudan and Oxfam with funding support from the European Union. The farm inputs distributed include 1550 MPK fertilizers, water pump machines, among others. The state coordinator Oxfam, Ibrahim Umar, explained that the gesture is aimed at improving nutrition and food security in communities through providing farm inputs and training on improved agricultural practices. This input we are giving it in the, like a loan basis. The farmers will pay the first 50% to take the input. So after the harvest, they pay the remaining 50%. For the executive director, Crudan, Root Doll, the replication of the program to Maiha, Gombi, Maabelwa and normal local governments is due to the successes recorded in the four pilot local councils of Fofore, Guyuk, Song and Mubi South. The reason for this project is to ensure that we deal with the issue of hunger, with the issue of poverty. And if we don't support the groups right from the beginning with farm imputes, they cannot deal with hunger and they cannot deal with poverty. On his part, the chairman, Maiha local government, Dr. Idi Aminu, appreciated the PRO Act for the initiative, which he described as the gospel of change and economic development. Among all the NGOs I've ever come across, they are the most God-fearing, very accommodating, respectable, and uh, they are just like uh, a religious family. He assured the NGO of the unflinching support of his administration to achieve the state goal of the project. The Pro Resilience Action Pro Act program is out to improve food security and livelihood in 70 rural communities of Adamawa and Kebi states. <laughs> Helda Jesse Leduma, 2-6 News.